Weighted groundbreaking happened today for a new pedestrian bridge over West Burnside. It will be called the Barbara Walker Crossing in honor of one of Portland's biggest champions of parks and trails. And as Fox 12's Kelsey Watt shows us, it will connect the Wildwood Trail between the Hoyt Arboretum and Pittock Mansion. This new crossing will connect the trail behind me to the other part of the trail across Burnside. And just with the cars out here today, you can see how important this project will be for safety. Easier said yeah. than done. Yeah. <laughs> the project is being spearheaded by the Portland Parks Foundation in partnership with Parks and Rec, Peabot, and Metro. They estimate that 80,000 people use the Wildwood Trail every year. But in this section where it crosses Burnside, there's a curve with limited visibility, no crosswalk, and according to city leaders, a third of the drivers here exceed the speed limit. This project has been in the works for years. It will cost just over $3 million, and the Portland Parks Foundation raised two-thirds of the cost from private donors and philanthropic organizations. The rest will come from the city. And if you hike in this area, you should know that sections of the Wildwood Trail will be closed during construction. Yeah, but it'll make it easier probably to use the trail and probably for cars too, then they don't have to worry about you know, like this particular area of the road. The bridge is being fabricated off site to minimize traffic disruptions, but there may be occasional lane closures for construction and West Burnside will be closed completely for a few days at the end of the project when the bridge span will be lifted into place. Construction will begin later this month and the project is expected to be finished by September. Reporting along West Burnside, Kelsey Watts, Fox 12 Oregon.